Today's William is so much better than we envisioned when he was younger. Behavior was an issue, temper tantrums, what I call a blind rage. It, it was rough. It was rough. We joined SPARK because we wanted to learn more and maybe find out what caused these symptoms. To be honest, we really didn't expect to hear anything. William has been a ball boy for 14 years. He is so dedicated to making others proud of him. He wants people to be happy with him. He has a girlfriend, her name is Sarah. They just celebrated their sixth anniversary. With William being 30 years old, you feel like you've learned all you can learn. When the geneticist called to give me the news that they had found a genetic reason, I was floored. His number 17 chromosome has several genes that have been duplicated, and that is the cause of his autism. It took such a weight physically off of my shoulders that I didn't know I had. Um, wondering if we had caused, sorry. <laughs> there were so many questions as William was growing up, and the answer with this piece of paper is, he would have been this way no matter what. With this information, it opens the doors to a different path. The geneticist plugged us into a support group for people who have this 17Q12 duplication syndrome. I find that I'm able to use my experience to offer assistance. And if that's the purpose, then that's the purpose. Looking back, it would have been fantastic to have someone to talk to who was going through the same thing and to have a group of women my age who understood what was happening. I see nothing but hope in research because there are so many people with truly good intentions to move forward and to educate and to open doors for the future. If anyone were to ask me whether they thought they should join the research, I would say do it. And you may find something incredible.